Now welcome to the third part of my video. Now we will be working on how to cite questionnaires to collect information from all the family members. Now, now for this first you need to put name of the family members. It's your first statement or question. And just I am pasting it from my other file. This will come in the text format. Now, your next question will be uh, relationship of of the dead with relationship related with household head maybe for here options could be um, self self I'm putting this because you have already asked a question with the household head in the previous section or in the upper part of the questionnaires here you can put spouse, child, child. You need to think this in the real sense. When I was conducting survey in Bazura, I had missed putting brother-in-law and while doing pilot test, such concerns came from the enumerators and I corrected. Rent. Grandchild, child, maybe grandparent, parent, brother in law, law, sister in law, sister in law, and finally, oh, her. Right, so you can keep extra metal values two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eighteen. These XML values are important when you download XML files later when data is collected. Now here we need to we need to set and go to the setting and put for example keep a code code here for the name of the family member maybe you can just uh, what you can do is just uh, let me just say F1 or let's put A1 A A1 and just close it and here as well we have specified relationship of uh, you need to keep this sign dollar sign and put this in the in this type con comma now this this one a one say a one with household head now here what we did just to remind you first we clicked on the setting button and in the data column name we said a1 in the first question and in the second question is relationship of a1 with household head let's check it in the preview mode 
then it will, then it will be easier to understand here there is the for example name of the family member if we say oh, Max the name of the family member Max then it should Form uh, is valid. Let's try one more time. Let's go here and set it. Uh, uh, we get different options. Here, what you need to do is you need to set in the command we forgot we missed that part here we need to do is relationship of a1 with household head it's correct it should uh, display now uh, let's check it again In the following questions, you will you will read. Uh, let's set sure some more questions. Then it will be easier to understand. A relationship of A1 with household head. Household head. Then other question would be age of A1. Right? Age of. Let's say. Let's set another question. Age. Of, as of sign if sign and close it a one write it a just this comes in the number format relationship maybe here we we forgot to well, let me set this question again because we didn't choose just if you have to insert here you click over there and put your question this should come in the text format therefore earlier on we had missed putting that option therefore it didn't appear exactly how we wanted similarly now next question would be education education of education of education of a1 education of a1 education of of a dollar sign then this one a one and close the bracket here we see we have to be very careful we keep bracket instead of another sign now uh, once you put all of the information here options could be um, education as, uh, as we have already uh, written earlier, illiterate, illiterate, uh, simply literate, simply literate, literate, basic education, education, high school. Uh, 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 and uh, university to put author for uh, just keep external values so that it will be easier when you export it to the SPSS file and hit for other for now let's do it until here you set it say let's save it again 
Now let's check it from here. Bad getaway. Might be internet issue. Let's check from here. Okay, it's working now. Here, here we should have put next. It was it was not displaying anything. She check it. A relationship of the nothing is here. But if you write here, uh, Hori, now you will see relationship of Hori with household head. Similarly, relationship of Hori with all the following is of Hori. Education of Hori. This way. You say it with the dollar sign and different codes, then it will be easier. Now, uh, now if you want, if you want to repeat all of these questions, you just have to duplicate, duplicate, duplicate those questions. But for now, I don't really have to duplicate. Uh, I will show this in another video in my other series. For now, you can you can just set those questions with those formulas to collect all the information of family members available in the household head. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you like. Please don't forget to put your comments and subscribe my channel. Thank you.